Hello, I'm Dr. Paula Woodward from the University of Utah, and today I'm going to be discussing the placenta with you. Today we're going to talk about the placenta, and uh, I was also assigned the umbilical cord, but because of time, we're really going to focus on the placenta. And the placenta is really a fascinating organ in that in your entire life, it's the only organ that it's time limited and disposable. Also, it's the only organ that you actually share. It's a, both from uh, fetal and maternal origin. Uh, now, in a uh, legal dispute, the fetus would win on this because the larger portion actually is formed by the fetal chorion, but the endometrium plays a key role in the decidua basalis. The placenta has many important functions. It's a physiologic barrier. This is where all the gas nutrient exchange occurs, and it also has important endocrine functions. Now, I want to start by talking a little bit about the embryology. And we all know fertilization occurs here in the tube, and cell division starts as it travels down the tube until you get this cell uh, bundle, this ball called the morula. And that morula starts to differentiate into a bottom layer and a uh, outer layer here. And that's the blastocyst. And it's this blastocyst from which the placenta will start to form. The blastocyst has several layers to it. First of all, inside you have the embryo blast, all right? And that's going to be the embryo. But we really want to pay attention to the outside here. And it's got two parts to it. 